just kind of give you a little background. I was that guy in high school, the guy that no drug uh, person really liked to be around because I would throw their drugs away. Uh, so if my buddies use drugs, they knew that don't use drugs around Kevin, I'm going to toss them, uh, it messes you up. And so I was kind of like that goody goody two shoe guy. Um, and I've evolved from that. Uh, I, I think I was really extreme on, on it. I was is extremely a little bit judgmental, uh, frankly, uh, because I saw its impact on certain people. And I was like, I don't want to go there. Um, so I became kind of extreme when I was younger. Yeah. And then, you know, as a physician, you're, you're trained to all these drugs. Like you suddenly become this, you know, uh, at some of my, you know, patient friends will say I'm like a drug pusher, you know, it's like, uh, and, and, and you kind of start to realize, shit, kind of, I kind of am, uh, you know, um, and, and then, and you don't even realize you got there, you know, and, and then finally, then you start to realize, wait a minute, um, all these medications that I'm starting, uh, they have a, a very built in innate, you know, problem if you keep adding more and more and more uh, and we're not healing anything i'm not against meds uh in the appropriate situations they can be very helpful but they, we get too often where we get cookbook and we go okay this has this so we'll start this medication yeah. and and by, before you know it that cookbook uh is is now there's an, a menu of medications that that person's on and finally i got to a point in my career where i was like wait a minute I need to start looking at these things as tools and not as uh, substitutions forever. And so, you know, it moved into, uh, like I worked hospice. Um, that was one of my many hats that I worked in, in as a physician. Um, and, you know, you start to appreciate the pain and the suffering that people go through. And my understanding of marijuana, for example, really started to evolve and appreciate rather than looking at it from a social standpoint yeah. started to kind of realize hey marijuana has a incredible um potential to help pain and suffering um help with nausea with appetite and so you start to kind of realize wait a minute and, and this is how i think medicine has been really good for me it's like it kind of starts to help you learn that life is very gray uh, there's a lot of in-betweens and you have to be very flexible. You cannot get caught up on just this one way of targeted therapy and thinking. And so with marijuana, for example, you know, I was like, okay, um, all right, I can, I can wrap my head around that. And then I started to learn about it because some of my friends were anesthesiologists and pain specialists and they were, they were really all for it. And at first, again, I was a little bit, um, I would say judgmental. Um, I was kind of like, oh, oh, they're going down the, you know, like every other Californian, uh, going down this marijuana pathway. Hi, John Malaki here with United Patients Group. I hope you've enjoyed our videos. Please click like, as well as subscribe to our channel here on YouTube. Also, follow us on Twitter at U Patients Group and on Facebook at United Patients Group as well as for our podcast. Please click the link in the description below. We'll see you there. Bye-bye.